Hello and welcome back to Scorched Earth. We have a storm going on. So during the storm, I think I'm going to fix our house. We cannot have stone. We have to have adobe. So I'm going to change everything out to adobe. And that's what I'm going to do during the storm. And then I'll bring you guys back tomorrow morning. Yeehaw! Wow. So cool. Alright. So I got the house finished. I'll show you that in a little bit. But right now I'm in the middle of uh, painting our outfit and in arc painting is pretty cool shoot i don't have enough wood i need to get some wood go over here watch for the i'm always looking up at that hill to watch for that wyvern that's up there make sure it's not coming down this way <laughs> all right i've got some wood we got a, co a cook pot and we're going to throw some wood and a cook pot and all this water and the spark powder. I don't need that. No thatch. Just some wood. Water jugs and spark powder. And we're going to make up some paint. Turn it on, let it go, and boom, you got paint. All right. I need some more berries and I need some more water. Throw this in there. I love the morale tops. They're great harvesters. Let me get these berries. And you can also fill your water canteens up. See, it says fill inventory canteen containers. I can't talk. Sorry. <laughs> oh, she doesn't have enough water. And then to fill her up, all you do is get your hatchet out of your hand and your crossbow. Dope. <laughs> We're going to take her right down here to the water. And all you do is just walk right out in the water and she'll fill her humps up. And then you have 750 gallons of water in her humps. That's pretty freaking cool. She is awesome. The only thing you gotta do is make sure you get far enough in the water. Is that far enough? No? A little bit further. How's that? Oh yeah, there she goes. <laughs> and she's so cute. I mean, look how cute she is. Fill them humps up, girl. She's adorable. These things are tanks, too. They're just big. They're very big and cumbersome. There you go. Come on. You can do it. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> you can always tell when they're done. When they do that, that right there. She's, fun. She's finished. My goodness, I'm having a hard time talking today. Can't put a sentence together. But she is done. She is finished. All filled up. <laughs> They're fast, too. Get her around here by the cook pot so we can make some more paint. All right. Now, if you notice, my jugs are in here. All you do is click on that fill inventory containers. And there we go. They're all full. Pretty cool. I do like that. Especially out in the desert. All right. I'll take those narcotics, too. I'll throw all this paint in here, and we're going to make up some more paint. There we go. Cool beans. Thank you, girl. Now I'm going to paint up my outfit. And painting in ARC is easy too. All you do is go to your paint and just click on the paint and see everything that lights up. That's everything you can uh, paint. Then you just click on the item that you want to paint and this window opens. And all these areas that have an open box up there, you can pick any of them and pick a color. And it'll put that color in there. Like I'm going to pick magenta for that. And then all I do is go down to the bottom and click apply and see how it fills it up, makes it all pink. And then I'm going to pick, I think I'll do yellow. You just have to decide what you want to paint your stuff. Maybe yellow for that. Or magenta. Um, probably magenta. Yeah. There we go. And do I want yellow or magenta for that one? Or do I want yellow or magenta for that one? I think I'm going to put yellow here. Not there. There. 
There we go. And then magenta is going to be on the scarf. That one's the scarf. I want magenta. All right. Woohoo! I'm going to paint everything else. It's very simple. Arc is very easy for painting. All right. I got everything painted. Looks pretty good. I am not sure if I like yellow, but I'm going to give it a shot for a little while. It's usually cayenne. I like cayenne and magenta. But I'm going to try out this yellow since we're in the desert. See, see if I like it. We'll give it a shot. Okay, so I've got a big surprise for everybody. I have been working very hard to upgrade our house to Adobe. Now, I am high enough for a saddle. Do, 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 do. Here we go. Wham! We have a thigh cola saddle. Let me tell you, my favorite animal, animal of art is a thigh cola. I love the thigh cola. Of all the animals on art, even the wyverns, well, maybe not the wyverns, okay. Of all the land animals <laughs> on art, the thigh cola is my favorite of all the land animals. And this is why. Because you can take a thigh cola anywhere. They're ferocious. And if you build up their weight, they can carry anything. And buddy, if you want to go there, they can take you. Right up the side of a mountain. No big deal. Get on up. Choop. Is that not like the coolest thing you've ever seen? I love a thigh cola. All right. I haven't been up here yet because that wyvern's right over on the other side of this ridge. So I wanted to come up here just to see what it looked like. I see metal. I was hoping there would be some sulfur up here. There's metal. I got lots of metal around here. No shortage of metal. And oil. There's oil no nodes around here too. I just have to make, I don't think I'm high enough for an oil rig yet or an oil pump. I, I'm hoping I can find one in a drop. I don't have to make it. I'm looking for, make sure that wyvern's not up here. So if a wyvern, if this is a spawn spot for a wyvern, will they make nest up here? I don't know. Well, is the only place you can get an egg in the, um, in the uh, wyvern trench? Or will the wyvern lay eggs up here because this is their spawn area? Or is this a spawn area? This wyvern's been here ever since I got here. See, there he is right there. Level 75 fire wyvern. That's the one that killed me in my thigh cola and my Bertha, my first one. But I don't see any nest. Get these. Come here, y'all. I don't want to get too close to the edge. Come here. Come here. I don't want you messing with me. Get me, get me in trouble. Get my thigh cola killed. Sneak up to the edge and see if we can get a look at this fire wyvern. So if the fire wyvern is over here, it would make sense that they would have a nest, right? There it is. Oh, they're so awesome. I do love the wyverns. I do love the wyverns. I want one. I want a, I want a, a lightning wyvern. I've never had one of those. I've had the fire. I haven't had the poison either. So I want a poison and a fire. Ooh, you're wyvern food. <laughs> Oh, wow, look at you. What level are you? Oh, you're low level. Ooh, that wyvern is close. Holy moly, yeah, we're out of here. I do not want to take a chance of that wyvern because they have a very large um, window of, of attack. Their hit, their hit area is very large, and I don't want to take a chance, so we're going to get the heck out of there. Ooh, bye, Cola. Hello, Thy Cola. A 95. I'm going to leave it alone. I haven't seen these super high uh, Thy Colas. The highest one I found was this one that I'm riding. He was 120. And I have a 100, 100 female. I'd like to get 150s. That would be nice. I'm still looking for them. I'm out here. I'm going to look for um, some utility animals. I want another camel. A male. I want to make a baby because I want to see what the babies look like. <laughs> I also need an Anki because I am tired of beating up on rocks and trying to get metal. And I want a thorny dragon. 
for wood so I don't have to beat any more trees so that's what we're doing we're looking for all these animals that are going to help us with our harvesting oh, there's an Anki all the Ankies I've seen so far 50 60 <gasps> 140 oh yeah we're taming this Anki stop the train we're taming the Anki folks all right See if there's anything around here that's going to fight her. I don't want to start taming her and have something come up and try to kill her. Alright. I have a thiacola pin over this hill right here, right on the other side of these uh, bones. And I would like to get this Anki in the thiacola pin only because when it starts running, you don't control where they run. And I don't want her to run out because there's some um, there's a couple of Carnos on the other side of this hill over here. And I don't want her running over there. And of course, there's Thiacolas over that way. There's just a lot of bad things over here. Hyena dons, all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to put her in this pen for her own safety. Come on, girl. She just lost interest in me pretty quick. Like, I don't know what you want, but I'm done with you. <laughs> See, now the game's starting to get fun. Now that I'm past, I'm not past all the death. I'm sure I'm going to have a lot more death in my, in my future. But the one right after the other death, <laughs> the hardest time. When you first get started in ARC, that's the hardest time. Finding a place that's relatively safe, building it up, taming your first animal. It gets very difficult, and you get frustrated because you get killed so much. This map, I've never been killed more than I have on this map. So I'm not underestimating this map at all. None. <laughs> Come on. What are you doing? Oh, I'm drunk. Drunk driver. Drunk driver. Come here, you. Come on. Would you just get in the pen? I'm trying to keep you safe. As soon as you start running. Come on. Come on in here. Seriously? Boy, this little booger loses his attention really quick, doesn't she? Come on, girl. Focus. Focus. Come on, little one. Just focus. Just for a minute. Get you in this pen. There you go. Don't give up. You can do it. Oh, level on my thylo. Yay. Come on, get in. Yes, very good. Okay, I'm going to get her knocked out. <laughs> Beating up on my pen. Did I even hit her on that one? I didn't see the red. Huh. So if anybody knows how to turn on the... Um, Ooh, ooh, no, 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 stop, stop. What are you doing, knucklehead? Oh, man. Sorry, girl. He did not mean to bite you, okay? He was just playing. He's a little rough. He didn't mean it. Wasn't trying to eat your face off, I promise. Sorry about that. Poor little thing. <laughs> I'm gonna get her knocked out. So does anyone know how to turn on... Or what command turns on the uh, amount of damage you do when you hit an animal? Like mine doesn't show when I when I shoot anything, it doesn't show. So I wanted to see if anybody out there knows how to uh, turn that on. So if you do, please tell me. All right, we're gonna let her. We're gonna let her get a little hungry. So I'm just gonna buzz around for a while and check the area and have a little fun. Because I love my thigh cola. Oh, look. Ruins. Should have one of those, either a box or a jug around here somewhere. Is it over here? Where's it at? There's an explorer note here somewhere. Where is it? 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 Come here. Come here. Come here. Where's it at? Where is it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I didn't see it. Yeehaw. I think this is our eighth one. I think so. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, this is our eighth one. Yeehaw. 
All right. Hey, bug. Woohoo! All right, we're just gonna run around until she's ready to get up. See if I see any thylos or see if I see a thorny dragon or anything like that. Uh oh, storm's coming. She's up. She's up. All right. 209. Not bad. Not bad. Let me knock this down. Can I get to it? There we go. Take this down. Come on, girl. She's got little yellow spikes. <laughs> Come on. Let me change your follow to lowest. There we go. Put the saddle on you. There you go. Give you a little armor there. I'll take those narcotics. Thank you very much. Come on out of there. Come on out. There you go. All right, let me put this wall back up. Because if I see another thylo up here, I might have to tame it. You never know. I got these pins all over the place. <laughs> I put them everywhere. <laughs> there we go. Come on. All right. Ooh, green drop. Is that a green? Yeah. All right, girl, you stay here. I don't see anything that's going to hurt you. Nope. Nothing here from what I see. So you stay here. I'm going to run get this green drop. I'll be right back. Woohoo! Oh, it's got a ring around it, too. Yay! Let's get this green drop. Oh, wow. Not bad. Throw all this junk I don't need away. There we go. Ooh, Thilo. Hello, Thilo. A 50. Man, I saw the most beautiful Thilo up here. She was a 100. And by the time I got that pen built, she was gone. I don't know where she went. And I didn't even get close to her. But she was gone. So I'm still looking for her. Hey, bug. All kinds of bugs up here. Yeehaw! All right, girl, come on. Let's go home. I'm going to get her home, and on the way, I'm going to harvest some metal. Because there's a lot of metal noids up here, too. Come on, girl. Come on. She's pretty heavy. <laughs> I filled her up full of metal. Yeehaw! Hi, guys. We're home. We have a new addition to the family. Let's see if we can get her up here. Come on, girl. Come say hello to everybody. Oh, man. I have wanted an Anki for so long. Come on, girl. All right, let me get her. Uh-oh. You stay there, bud. Sorry, I thought I'd put you on stop. Let me move him out of the way. Come on. Come on, big kitty. Get over here. Aw. Shoot. Yeah, she had babies. I didn't get back in time. Poor little guys. So, anyway, let me get her. I'm going to change her name. Her name is going to be Medellin. Because <laughs> she's a female. I normally call her Metalhead, but I'm not going to call her Metalhead. We're going to call her Medellin. Okay, you get around here. I'm going to unload her, put the metal in the forge. Uh-oh, I'm stuck. All right, back up some. Back up. Back up a little, please. What are you doing? Okay, she wouldn't move. She was just sitting there. Like, I don't want to. There we go. Okay, I'm just going to put all the metal in the forge. And then I'll move her out of the way. Okay. All right, I'm going to move her out of the way. I think I'll move her over here next to the Dodicarus. That way they can do girl talk. I'm not sure if the Dodicarus is male or female. I don't know. i got to name the poor little thing. haven't even named him. Her or it or whatever it is. All right, y'all. Everybody on neutral? I want you all on neutral in case something bad comes up here. Y'all can protect the little guys. 
Okay, I want to finish the greenhouse. Do I have everything? I think I do. Where am I going? <laughs> I'm scatterbrained. <laughs> this wall is driving me crazy. I was able to fix the ceiling. I got that in. But now I need to fix this wall. And I guess I need to put in this pillar. What's it doing? Oh, it's sticking to the ceiling. Like, why is it up in there? <laughs> That's why. So I need to put that pillar. Where do I need to put it? Over here? Over here? I want to make sure that it's... Yeah, over here. All right. Good. There we go. Look at all the silicone pearls down there. Y'all see them? Yeah, I got everything. See all them silicone pearls down there? My cabinet is full of silicone pearls. I, I pick them and they come back. Gotta love it. And now when you click these things on there so that you don't get the nub, you gotta make sure you're on that second click. See how it jumped down twice? Make it jump down all the way so that you don't have to worry about, uh, about the nubs. All these silicone pearls are so many. And then I got a floating pillar. Why? I don't know. It just kind of floats up there. I'm going to get rid of it. I'm not a good builder at all. Not even close. So, But I'm trying. I'm doing my best. I may have to put something. I don't know if I'm going to put anything there. But I'm finished. Yeehaw. I got my cabinets almost full of silicone pearls. I got so many. That's one thing about this area. It's rich in resources. The only thing that's not here is crystal, obsidian, and sulfur. Those three I have not found. But I'll have to go up in the mountains to find them, I guess. Haha, <laughs> sounds like a road trip. Road trip? Well, let's get in here. Let's get this wall up. Yes. Oh, I got to get those walls do got them over here there we go I only have two I didn't make up is it two or four I need ah oh, it's four okay so let me throw these down I'll grab two more yeah let's take this up ha ah, no nub no nub yay let's grab two more walls and we'll be done with the greenhouse I love it. Love it, love it. Okay, let's put in these walls. There we go. Yeehaw! Alright. Get a drink of water. Okay. The only thing I don't like is that gap right there. I think I got an idea um, maybe how I can fix it. Can I do that? No. All right. Let me grab these rails. I'll think on it for a minute. I want to put some rails up around the balcony out there. I don't have enough. I got to go make rails. Arr, always something. Let me put this out. This is going to be my fishing area right here. I'm going to take you. Move you out here. There we go. Make this our fishing area. So we can sit and fish, and we don't have to worry about anything. We can fish from either side. Oh yeah, I like it. Now I've got some rails. I'm gonna put some rails. I'm gonna put rails all the way around, except for the fishing area there. I need to make some more rails for this side, but it's gonna look good. I think so. Yay! All right, now let me show you how I'm gonna fix this. I've I've got a fence foundation. Let me find the right spot. Hang on. I don't want it there. No, I don't want it there. Yeah, I want it there. And then we're going to put a pillar down. Is that all the way through? Yeah. Okay. And then we're going to put a pillar up. There we go. Let's put these all the way up. They look pretty. I think I can get away with these. If not, then I think I might swap them out for the adobe. But I'm going to see what stone looks like first. It kind of breaks it up because I have to change the floor to adobe too. Let's look on the outside. Woohoo! Yeah, that'll do. 
All right, y'all. Well, that's going to do it for this episode. So if y'all like this video, make sure you give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. Yeehaw! Our house is done, baby.